mix stems are a great way of managing a uh, final mix when you've got lots of elements going on perhaps consider bouncing them down to a simple set of stereo mixes so all the kicks split the drums in half have half going to one half to the other maybe all the drums in one go in this case we've got bass drums one and two kicks and pads and that gives us the whole mix and you can just hear those elements there what I've done here is actually set up a compressor on each one and this is better than applying a, an overall compressor over the final mix it does allow you to achieve a bit more compression a bit of compression on the drums a bit of compression on the kick a bit of compression on the pads a bit of fit on the bass and so on because they don't interfere with each other in terms of the way the compression works and just a bit of limiting on the main stereo output and actually this works fantastically well in other respects because it allows you to edit and do chops and changes a lot easier than trying to manage lots and lots of different tracks and work out what's going on you can see where your edits are so in this case I've just taken a little chunk of the drums sliced it done a reverse let's play it back so you can do lots of clever little edits reverses stutters and those kinds of things very very easily when you're working with stems the downside of course is that you can't remix all the elements individually as you would do before. 